Okay, so for today's video, this is more of a personal opinion and more of a free form talk. There's no script for this. This is just me ranting maybe a little bit and hopefully conferring some information and finding some people who say, ah, hey, that girl is speaking the truth. Well, not the truth, but that girl is speaking something that matters. Today, I want to talk about something that is dearly in my heart, the left. I myself am a lefty. I vote left in every election. I am part of a socialist party in the country where I live. And I have political ambition to at some point be a representative in government for the left. But there are issues with the left. And those issues are something that I want to talk about. And hopefully give a critical way of looking at an organization at a ideology that's usually not very critical of itself. If you like these kind of videos, please subscribe and come back for more. I try and upload every two weeks. For those of you who don't know what the left is, the left is an ideology and we like to use terms like left and right to talk about these political ideologies. Uh, if we talk about the right, we usually talk about liberalism. If we talk about the left, we usually talk about something related to socialism. And to say that everything that is left is automatically socialism, that isn't quite correct. But for the sake of the video, I am going to use left and every denomination of socialism you can think of. Uh, except National Socialism, those guys were Nazis and they don't belong in this video. Get them out of here. The left. As a member of what's considered a left, a very left-leaning party in my own country, and as somebody with left-leaning ideologies, I stroll a lot of left-leaning subreddits, I have a lot of left-leaning friends, I have a lot of left Facebook groups, and I am concerned with the left. I see a trend with the left about having the idea that we are the ones who are speaking the truth all the time and that people who disagree with us are either stupid or misinformed. And we try to carry that over. Like we're in an argument and somebody makes a point about our policies and we are like, yeah, well, okay, but you are wrong. Conversation ended. How in the hell are you going to convince somebody that you're right? Right as in right and wrong, not right as in right and left. When you end a conversation immediately and you don't try and go into a discussion with somebody. I saw conversations happening where people who I know lean left and obviously have left leftist standpoints go to, well, you're right, so you would never get it. How are you gonna make somebody understand your point of view if you go to such a basic means of looking at things? In order for people to show that we in the left actually have valid points, we need to convince people, especially centrists, preferably people on the right, that there is something to be said for the left ideology. We can't just say, well, you're centrist or you're right, so you're wrong. No, go and talk with these people. And of course, you need to pick the correct medium to do that. Facebook is not a correct medium. On Facebook, everybody can spew their hatred, their ideas, their what they think out there and just say it without actually conversing to a person. It's just typing. The screen adds a boundary that makes connection almost real connection almost impossible but go to people talk to people don't be afraid but most of all be empathetic try and get their point of view don't say well you're wrong say i get where you're coming from but now look at it in my way and give them your point that's a general thing that as the left we need to regain we need to regain that idea of empathy like, I mean, the left is there for the lower class. The left is there for the people who are weaker in society. We are an empathic movement, but only for people who support us and who are in the same thing as us. We need to be empathic, empathetic to everybody. If we are not empathetic, 
people will never understand why we do certain things and why we hold certain values as important. So please, everybody who's left leaning, looking at this, don't automatically shame people for being from the right, for having uh, non-factual based uh, ideas. Talk with them. Just try and make a connection. Be empathetic to their cause. You catch a lot more flies with honey than with vinegar.